Hello everybody, welcome to another video. This is Sun from teleprompter.com. Today we're going to be speaking about the painful fact and reality of me losing 15.9 million views and what I could have had done if I could have had gained that views or what I should have had done if I could have actually even get closer to that view count. So this one is my video, which didn't really perform that well. Let's watch it together. I prefer to pull along the north-south axis. How crazy is that? Actually, according to this research, dogs poop in alignment with Earth's magnetic field. They examined around 70 dogs and 37 breeds over two years, and basically 1,800 something uh, poops and 5,500 pees. And you know, it's so boring that it's even painful for me to watch this video. Um, I can't, I can't even watch it, but you see the topic is the same and I actually I think it was the first person who brought this topic to uh, to Instagram, it was posted on November 23rd. And now I'm going to show you the video that performed way, way, way better than this and I'm going to tell you why. So here is the other video. Do dogs turn in circles before they poop? You may be thinking, they're just weird little guys doing weird little things. Nope, they are calibrating to Earth's geomagnetic field. A study conducted by scientists in the Czech Republic and Germany found that dogs use Earth's magnetic fields to align their bladder and bowel movements. Think of a dog turning around to poop like the spinning of a compass needle. They further concluded that dogs prefer to relieve themselves along the north-south axis. And so just, just from that thing alone, yeah, it's like it has around 700 like, 700,000 likes and around 16 million views and the thing I learned from this before I get into the specific things of technicalities is that there was one mindset that made me lose on this whole thing and that was that I just didn't really put that much effort in my video and when it comes to producing content these days people are thinking about a lot of quantity over quality and that was my mindset when I was studying that and with this specific piece of content, what I did was I just stick a hook there and I just spoke and I didn't really use that many visual hooks as much as I should have had done these days and I just did really, really did a careless job. Comparing to this guy, his first thing is something very familiar that dog owners do, which is the dog turning around when they're doing their business. And that thing is already familiar to the person who already has a dog. And they're like, oh, I was always wondering. So it has a wow factor. And it's like, oh, I wonder what this is. And this is the reason that they got a lot more views than me. Aside from the technicality is the mindset of just not doing a really good job on my piece of short. And another thing that it's very important for this piece is that it's even boring for me to watch my own video. And the reason for that is because I'm just really boring. I'm just talking and I'm just reading a study and I'm even like, you can even hear it in my energy, in my voice, that I'm just like really not having it there. But the way he talks about it, you can see the visual pictures comes up, you can see the images come up and it's a complete different experience for the viewer. And God knows how many followers they got from that and uh, how much engagement they got from that and how much more their channels got because of that one single video. And that video was posted probably six months after me. And I could have had basically been that person if I had the mindset of not really just doing a bad job on my reels and putting more effort and testing them before posting them. And having a hook is really good. Having a written hook is very good. But what's better than having a written hook is having a visual hook. So let's watch this video again and say why it got these many views. Do dogs turn in circles before they poop? You may be thinking. So you see the first thing you see is the visual hook. That's how the dog is circling. And it's a very familiar thing. And he also poses a question. Why do you think there's circle? So magnetic fields to align their bladder and bowel movements. Think of a dog turning around to poop like the spinning of a And he catches you. He's like, oh, there's just weird little things. So he does connect to you because you did probably think that. And then it catches you. He's like, nope, they're actually aligning themselves with the geomagnetics. What I learned from this is that he's definitely written a, a script for this, or he has bullet pointed. He's really thought about what he's gonna say comparing to me, which was just like, you know, like winging it. A study conducted by scientists in the Czech Republic and Germany found that dogs- And having this visual does increase your retainment in your videos. And it's very important to keep this. And I bet you if he didn't use these visuals, he wouldn't have gotten this far with his reel. So another thing that this does is that it has such a wondering and wow factor that people will just come and comment 
on this post that, oh my God, that's no way. Oh my God, that makes sense. Oh my God, I've, I had no idea this thing was everything. Oh my God, I was um, underestimating my dog. And the funny thing is that he keeps it lighthearted. So that's another thing that's really important with this reel is that he makes jokes, he keeps it funny, he keeps it light. And that also really helps this reel to be shared and to be entertaining as well, aside from the educational part of it. And uh, just checking out the comment section. So you can see that people are also making jokes in the comment section and they, they, they basically are wondering how this thing has ever happened. Uh, does it even support or even making more jokes and that actually attracts a lot more engagement to your, reel as, uh, to your reels as well. All right, the moral of the story is next time that you're going to be posting a video, remember my face and my pain of how much I have lost if I actually spent a, a good 20-30 minutes to make my reel a little bit better and put more love into it and put more thought into it. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this, make sure you give us a thumbs up, subscribe or comment. If you want to speak as natural in front of the camera as I do, then you can use our app teleprompter.com. You can check our app in the description box below.